does the Bible give us a clue that Paul was, in fact, a false apostle? Consider the following points. Point 1. Paul writes to the Church of Ephesus, located in Biblical Asia, and presents himself as an apostle of Jesus. Paul, an apostle of Christ Jesus by the will of God, to God's holy people in Ephesus, the faithful in Christ Jesus. Ephesians 1, 1. Point 2. Paul later laments that he was deserted by all of Biblical Asia. You know that everyone in the province of Asia has deserted me, 2 Timothy 1 15. Point 3. The second and third chapters of the book of Revelation are addressed to seven churches in Biblical Asia. While they are rebuked for many sins, they are not questioned for abandoning Paul. Now, if Paul was a true apostle, and if the churches of Asia made a mistake by deserting Paul, then why were they not rebuked for rejecting Paul? Wouldn't they have received at least some rebuke for rejecting Paul? Point 4. In Revelation 2, the church of Ephesus, to whom Paul claimed to be an apostle, is commended for testing and rejecting false apostles. We read in Revelation 2, verse 2, I know that you cannot tolerate wicked people. That you have tested those who claim to be apostles but are not, and have found them false. So, if Paul presented himself as an apostle to Ephesus and was rejected, and if Ephesus is commended in Revelation for rejecting false apostles, what does that make Paul? I say that it proves Paul was a false apostle. Who do you think he is? Thank you for watching. Please like, subscribe and share.